Okay, what I have here is a little power supply that I took out of an old flatbed scanner and these white wires go off to run the light that runs across in the scanner bar. It's uh, similar to a fluorescent strip light running out of the bench supply. On the output I have a little bridge rectifier and a 400 volt um, transorb or tray sill voltage limiter. The green wire simulating the feed from the ignition is your positive, blue wire is your negative, all commoned together. I've now got a spark plug connected. This extra little black wire is just simulating the earth. I've got it connected up to the pickup. So if I connect the green wire to get the high voltage supply on there. And if I now run the pickup, I've got the plug firing. I can vary the speed and check that it's firing OK. And this is how I test modules to see whether they're working or not and that the coil in them is OK. Uh, it's also a trick you can use if you think you've got a faulty high voltage winding is to rig one of these power supplies up to a battery power the ignition that way. Um, particularly if you've got a weak kick starting leg and you can't kick the bike over fast enough to generate the spark. Um, this is a way of making it get a, get a fatter spark um, for starting.